as you guys can see on the bottom right corner it is saying three mods loaded instead of two and if you go in mods you can see one more mod that is just enough I JEI is an item and we Okay, hey, what is going on guys? It is Fraxer here and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna let you guys go know how to uh, you know install Forge for Minecraft 1.15.2 and in and in that way install mods for that version. And actually this uh, process is uh, applicable for any version. <coughs> actually I have a bit of a cuff and yeah guys please take care. I you know a lot of bad stuff is going on in this world. Please take care of yourself. I'm all good. It's just a minor cuff that I have. And let's just go straight into the video. So first you have to do, all you have to do is open a browser. I'm using Google Chrome in my case. And there, type in Minecraft Forge. So then hit enter. So Forge is like, a, you know, like you have Optifine, which is a profile in Minecraft launcher. Just like that, even Forge is, you know, and yeah, I'm extremely sorry. Open the first link that pops up after you type in Minecraft Forge, or I will, you know, just put the link down below in the description. And yeah, so it is like an, you know, interface for, I mean, it's like a profile through which you can load mods, mo mods for Minecraft. And we are going to download Minecraft uh, Forge for 1.15.2. That is this latest version right here. And they have even specified a recommended version so depends on you whether you want to go for the recommended i mean that's the most stable when they they are gonna suggest you or if you if you guys want to go for an like 1.10.2 you can just go here on the left side of the screen and just click on 1.10.2 and download that minecraft forge but we are going to download uh, minecraft forge for 1.15.2 so here i am and here you have to click on install installer uh, and we are gonna download the latest version so here click on installer okay and then let it download and yeah here don't click anywhere else you know they will show this stuff it's just add okay they're asking me to show notifications no don't click it actually it is just a five seconds ad as you can see on the top part of the screen just skip uh, just click skip here and then you will be able to download as you guys can see it's now downloading and looks like it's gonna take a bit of time. Let me just click block here. Oh yeah, and it's almost done. So now they will ask we, uh, whether I wanna keep this file. This type of file can harm your computer. Do you want to keep forge dash dash dash? So this is this is a safe file, okay? Yeah, you can click on keep. Just make sure that sometimes the ads that are shown here are uh, just say that download down download if you click the download and something else downloads then make sure that the uh, file that is written here is forged and the um, um, version of the minecraft after that so in our case it's forged 1.15.2 then we are just gonna hit keep it's gonna uh, you know complete the downloading process and now uh i'll go in the downloads folder here oh yeah and forge is downloaded so here all I have to do is click on this, you know, double tap, okay? And if you have the Java uh, version, if you have the, you know, actually there's some uh, particular Java uh, platform, something like that required, which is in, which uh, you will already have if you have Minecraft. So in my case, uh, I already have it. So here, this small menu type thing will pop up. Make sure that install client is checked and don't do anything here. Don't change the location and just click on ok it will go on downloading all the stuff downloading libraries and then it might take some time depends on the process and yeah i also you know created this wallpaper on my own yep this is a real minecraft creation that i have created in my minecraft world and yeah successfully installed client force for version 1.15.2 so yeah as i was talking this was a wallpaper that i created i will you know what today I will even uh, no not today okay yeah not today leave it leave that wallpaper aside and then click on Minecraft launcher I have this thing here right here it will open let me make it a bit small 
So I have a Minecraft launcher open right here. So normally if you have installed a new profile then it will just be like your default for once you know. So I have this force already tagged. If, if you don't have an option of force right here, go into installations. Here, just forget that this thing is here. It's like it's never, it was never there. Click on new, and then this new create new installation thing will pop up. You can choose any icon you want. You know, let's just pick the creeper hat that head that school. You can name it. You know, Minecraft food one dot fifteen dot two dot two. Then here, pick up the version. Here, you will see that uh, release one dot fifteen dot two forge. It's here. And then game directory is used default directory and then resolution is depends on your monitor I've kept it in auto and here in more options that's I'm gonna give you a nice suggestion so this is a weird GVM argument don't change it only change the part that I'm gonna tell you to so here in this part that this XMX 2G this 2G uh, says um, it highlights the amount of RAM that has been allocated uh, to the Minecraft launch. Minecraft. Yeah, so in my case, I have an 8GB RAM laptop right here, but only 2GB RAM is alloc allocated. So, best, so the best thing to do is allocate around half of the RAM, you know. So in my case, I'm going to allocate uh, 4GB RAM um, because I have an 8GB RAM PC. If you guys have 16GB RAM uh, PC or laptop, just go for uh, 8GB. So I'm just gonna go for uh, 4. Don't change anything else, okay? Yeah, I've just changed that one digit that was 2. And now we are all done. Okay, Minecraft Force 1.15.2 and then hit create. And here, where is I? Yeah, there's our creeper head. So we are just gonna for others you can for those who already have this minecraft uh, forge option right here just go with it and i'm just gonna go with this creeper head guy that we just created both are absolutely same and yeah by the way this forge will have let me show you even this forge will have you know a uh, forge where i'm allocated by default i don't know why but it just i think they already determined half of the ram so that's why it's, it already has four four gig of ram so now all they have to do is uh and yeah there's even one more requirement so for example you want to play uh install force for minecraft 1.15.2 then you also have to you know at least have that version installed that is you have to at least you have at least played it once that's one requirement and that's it okay yeah so i have minecraft uh force installed right here so we are just gonna keep this aside let me just minimize it we're actually uh you know what let me make this process easier for you so just hit play so this is gonna be your first time so it's gonna take a bit of a time to complete all this stuff and process if you're uh, so we are just gonna leave that behind and let it process and we are gonna open up the browser again and let me just actually let me let it go on this uh, left side of the screen see it's downloading some stuff let it download and now I'm gonna tell you guys on how to you know so uh, yeah, uh, where you can download the mods we have the uh, thing to install to you know load uh, uh, mods in minecraft but where can we download mods let me show you oh yeah and yeah this is a this is one of those process it is the first time so it might take some time depends on a pc as you know say this is showing how much ram is being used so let it load FM, fml early loading process so let it load and we are going to uh, install mods in the meantime so just open up a new tab okay and then just click minecraft type in minecraft mods why is my pc lagging okay minecraft mods and then just hit enter there are two really famous websites for <coughs> actually my uh my mind uh my neck is a uh, throat is a bit dry i need to drink water afterwards so yeah there are two really famous uh, websites for downloading minecraft mods that is one is okay well that's that's unfortunate uh okay so yeah the minecraft started on its own let it load because i would not be will not be able to change the applications yet let it load i will even show you that how forge in uh, how the interface changes after installing forge uh okay so yeah it's now done let us just finalize it yeah freezing data 
boom so minecraft has been loaded and only one more new option has popped up and that's this mods when you open this it will show that these two mods are pre-installed well i don't know why they both are called mods while well, one is the profile and one is the game okay so yeah and yeah to make the uh, process easier i'm just gonna keep this thing open in the background let me s make the screen small yeah i'm just gonna uh, minimize it even you guys can minimize it because just to make the process easier okay yeah i'm gonna minimize it i've minimized it okay wait a second sorry sorry boom now minimize okay so first uh so yeah as we we're talking about the famous uh, two websites so first one is the curseforge.com and the second one is this planetminecraft.com and this website is an all-rounder website so you can have the resource packs and all the stuff like this or that and this is kind of the you can see that it has forge in its name it is dedicated to mods so yeah here we are this website is loading and actually this website even if it even when it has forge in its same it also you know provides you some resource packs and all so here a lot of let me get rid of this pop-up here a lot of mods will pop up thus recommended ones so for example you have to go we are choosing a mod for uh yeah and yeah your mod version and your forge version should match so I have a 1.15.2 Minecraft Forge, so I should I can only pick up a 1.15.2 mod. I cannot go for 1.13 mod and hope and hope that it will run. So here we're gonna select <coughs> 1.15.2. It has been selected. Now the filter has been applied and the website is reloading. Let it reload. And boom. All these mods which are supported by 1.15.2 have popped up. So yeah, I'll just go for just enough items. The first one in this uh well, I mean in this list just uh, click on that uh, on the name of that mod and it here uh, they will tell you all about what this mod is all about actually this mod will expand you know you might have seen this type of uh, inventory in the videos of other youtubers it lets you know the recipe it has the recipe books and all that stuff okay and I highly recommend you not to click download here because I don't know why the game version here determines the decides which uh, version you will download so here, here game version 1.12.2 1 is selected so you will download this mod for that version <coughs> so instead of that just scroll down and come here to this recent files section okay i did not mean to select all that to this recent files section and you'll see the latest one under minecraft 1.15 you can see that 1.15.2 is there you can uh hit download there or if you want to go if you're going for 1.13 from all the beginning just click download there we are going to uh, go for 1.15.2 so i'm going to hit install i uh, lo it's loading let it load and yeah your download will begin in one second and boom 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 yeah boom okay and yeah again that pop-up same pop-up is coming that this type of file can harm your computer no it won't okay yeah it's a mod just make sure that the file the name that is there is the mod you're downloading so in this case there is jei in the name there is also jei in this name so i'm gonna hit keep and boom it has downloaded and it will now again come in my downloads folder there see this is the mod file and well again to make the process easier just open minecraft again and then click on mods and here in this area click on open mods folder and here and this is a place where you have to keep your mods file to load it into minecraft so just hit it i mean click it and then it will you know open a folder and yeah this is the folder in which you have to keep uh, let me just minimize minecraft so this is the folder in which you have to keep your mods file so just you know just drag and drop it's that easy or you can you know like control i mean cut and paste it depends on you and see only after to do this much is that you have to pick the file and drop it in the mods folder and now i'll even minimize this thing minimize this minimize this and now i'll open minecraft but this uh the mod will not show up yet so all you have to do is you know restart minecraft so i'll hit quit game then i'll open minecraft again it is opening 
and only the long part is gonna be the loading part. It will even tell you that a new mod file has loaded. Why is it taking so much time? Okay, yeah. So I'm using the Forge profile and I'll just hit play. It will take some time and I know I'll just skip to the part where the Minecraft has loaded because this will take some time. So yeah. As you guys can see that they are now saying constructing three mods instead of two mods because we have we have one more mod on fire right now, you know, yeah. You can see we have one more mod. Yeah, see three mods loaded and yeah. Minecraft has loaded now. Let me just you know make it maximum make it full screen. As you can as you guys can see on the bottom right corner, it is saying three mods loaded instead of two. And if you go in mods, you can see one more mod. That is just enough items. JEI is an item and recipe viewing mod for Minecraft. Built from the ground up for stability and performance. And just remember one thing that the version of force that you are downloaded for Minecraft. The mod should be also of that version and in this case we have downloaded um, this mod for minecraft 1.15.2 and to show that the mod is actually working I'm just gonna uh, make a new world pretty quick make it survival I'm gonna just flat world I don't want a big world world and let the world be created come on quick my laptop is really slow guys I'm extremely sorry <sighs> Okay, yeah, my Minecraft has loaded, it is lagging a bit. So let me just, yeah, decrease this thing. And let's, yeah, I have a bit of FPS now. So yeah, this is just a super flat world. So there's nothing much to see here, actually. And let me show you the mod that is installed. And it is this mod. See, this is the just enough mods, just enough items mod. Uh, if I, you know, if I click R on something, it will show me how to create that thing if I press R and then if I uh, press U on any item it will tell me its uses you know I can use it to create a smoker uh, I can use a furnace you know and to create a blast furnace and a minecart with furnace and that's all you know yeah that's my just enough items mod installed right there so guys this is it this is the all the way all the process on how to install forge for minecraft and uh in and using forge how to uh install a mod